Master Data Management requires us to integrate and consolidate data from across our data state. Prophecy's strategy for integration is to allow our customers to use the integration tools they already own and understand to do that integration. One example of this is Prophecy's work we've done with the Azure Data Factory team to make it easy to use Azure Data Factory to integrate Prophecy with any other supported data source within Azure Data Factory. To make this easy, Prophecy has worked with the Azure Data Factory team to develop a set of publicly available Azure Data Factory pipeline templates. These allow your integration developers to quickly and easily move data in and out of Prophecy using native Azure Data Factory capabilities. Now let's take a look. Here I am in Azure Data Factory, and if I wish to go create a new pipeline, I can do so using an out-of-the-box pipeline template. Simply go create a new pipeline template, and then filter the list down to the templates that are published by Prophecy. Let's say I wanted to export some data from Prophecy to a CSV file. To do that, I simply click on that template, click Continue. And now all I have left to do is I need to configure my two link services. In this case, my first link service will be an Azure Data Lake storage account where my CSV file will be published. My other link service will pre Prophecy's own REST APIs from which we'll export the data. We go ahead and use this template. Now what we have is a pre-configured Azure Data Factory pipeline that will copy data from Prophecy's REST API to a CSV file on my Azure Data Lake. We can see here that the source and syncs and mapping information are all embedded within this copy activity. As you've seen in just a few steps, we're now ready to run this pipeline and move our data from Prophecy into Azure Data Factory. Keep in mind that the same thing can work in reverse, loading data from a data lake or other data sources into Prophecy, allowing you to quickly and easily integrate Prophecy with the rest of your data state.